and welcome back to the extra long run where we are playing Xenoblade Chronicles 3. So last time we uh, learned about Origin and uh, now we need to work toward actually getting there because it's it, it's in the middle of the Great Sea and of course the Great Sea in every Xenoblade game has, has like a maelstrom going, uh, going on. So we need basically we're gonna need a bigger boat to quote a certain movie. Before we do that, there's something that I wanted to check on, and I think it's in Forum's room. Um, right here. I'm not sure if uh, we're going to have access yet to the quest to upgrade Eno, but I want to see if we can do that. Because I want, I, I would like to unlock Eno's full potential. That sound. There's an airdrop nearby. What are we picking here? Hmm, that's not quite enough. Uh, we would need equities, loading cores, Sagittarius frames, Tetsudo shoulder guns, Ava spheres, variable centurus claws. Yeah. I'm gonna guess that, like, we have to get, like, maybe one more level and get it up to level 5. And then that might unlock the quest to upgrade, you know? Unfortunately, we're not quite there yet, so I guess let's just keep on the uh, main story quest. Maybe we'll find the materials that we need over the course of doing that. Um... Console room... The ultimate vessel. Here we go. So we need to go to Everblight Plain and Cape Archivore. So that's gonna be over here. I wonder, if, I wonder if we would have a better chance now of actually um, liberating that uh, abandoned for us. The outcome is patently clear. Not a big draw there. Uh, we did draw it the last time we were here, though, so it makes sense that there wouldn't be a whole lot. And now we are a fair bit stronger than we were. So I'm gonna try liberating this bronze again. Wow, Noah just got owned. Oh, what happened? Hmm. 
down go both our healers? How is this happening? Oops. All right, I guess we're not doing that. We gotta come this way anyway, because uh, the thing that we're looking for is over here. The origin metal signal was coming from around here, right? Let's sniff it out. You like treasure hunt. I mean, it's basically what that is. Coming from over that way. <laughs> Just randomly pick a race with Manana, I guess. At least there's only one of them. Plus he's a shiny, so you know. Better uh better blocks. Oh look at that, there is a uh a unique there. The gall, yes, I know. Um, so I gotta watch him. I can do that. The gall. Here's a tough Looks customer. Like a tough customer. Well, there's a will, there's a way. I hope. <laughs> This is probably going to be a little rough, but it uh, shouldn't be too bad. Especially since we should have combos at least up to days. I'm just kind of waiting for someone to throw a break on me. I mean, I'm not saying this is going to be a free fight. Nino's not doing great though. She's gone down. Senna, uh, Senna got aggro, which is good. And Nino's back up. Come on, let's get Drake on this guy. Oh dear. Noah took aggro for a second there. Not great. I'm getting the sense that uh, break doesn't work on this guy, which is not the best. We got level three intro and Confio. I do want to wait for that to finish. Senna's down. Oh. Aggro's a bit of a mess right now. Oh jeez, I got aggro. 
Mm, let's go ahead and chain attack. If we're gonna do anything you know, special, we may as well do it first. Uh, let's go ahead and use one of our healers for 25 ish. 78, and then use you now. And try to inflict break. Oh, we got break. So I think this will reactivate. Yep. Um. Agro is kind of a mess right now, so let's go with uh, you know. Um, we should have Topple. Follow that up with Days. I don't think I have any chance of getting uh, Bravo here, so let's just uh, finish off with Senna. This is not going to be a great chain attack, actually. It's it's cool that she's getting reactivated, but she has point limit. Ah, uh, if I do anyone else, I'm gonna run the risk of um, because the only person who can complete right now is Tyon. And if Mio gets reactivated, then I have Mio and Uni, and I'm not gonna be able to complete it again. So I'm gonna take Mio. Uh, since we're going directly into a uh, an Orboros order, let's go ahead and use Uni as well. And then finish up with time. One more point. Oh, we got a Bravo. <laughs> and look at that Mio reactivated again. Like it in like the chance was that. She would have been the first to reactivate, and I would have been screwed. So, limits in man, let's go. Um, and with you. Oh, that's a little high. 61 plus 39, which is the lowest, is gonna be 100. But I need to go into my healers. Beautiful though. I really wish that you wouldn't put, uh, that you wouldn't have one hand. Uh, do I want tie on or do I want me? I think I want tie on. Overkill. <laughs> Completely bypassing the uh, the enrage because uh, because the enemy was uh, raised.
And then you go back to Flash so Fencer. I can do that. I'll handle this. Now to ascend. It's already getting dark. Now to ascend. To go up or climb. I bet they're not all going to be quite this easy to get. Now we got two. Obviously won't. But let's head over to to Cadenzia. Oh, where is this? This is this is somewhere that I didn't actually finish mapping when I was uh, not to worry. out mapping Cadenzia. I'm not gonna bother with you if that's okay. Yeah, you just stay over there. Yeah, I'm not going near it because it's going to just aggro. Like, what's this? I don't remember that what that was for. Oh, that's a rare one. Shock to the system. Oh, hey. Maybe I don't want to be standing near this guy. Actually, you know what? I want to look up that shock to the system first. Oh, it's that lady who was uh, having a bad time because the entire uh, the entire city moved. Um, where did it go? There we go. We need. Egg seeds, heavy pomegranates, and recording roots. All found in Cadenzia. Looks like a pretty rare specimen. That is something that I will leave until after I'm done with the main story quest. Or if I will have plenty of time to just do all of these little side quests. And just kind of chill. Be the completionist I want to be. Get my probably 300 hours out of this game. <laughs> All right. Where to start? Behind waterfall, you say? Is it that unexpected? Something shining over there. It looks like a container, so I want to get that first.
the rule of video games, always look behind the, the waterfall. There's usually going to be a cave there. Not always, but usually. Alright, so we got two of the pieces. So now uh, we should be getting a call from... Uh, from... Uh, Samon. And tell us in us. Now I'm gonna guess that there's gonna be some like nasty surprise waiting at at least the last one. Also, what is with all these points of interest? Wow. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if there's going to be some nasty surprise waiting for us at one or both of these two. From? We'll find it. I dare say we're becoming old hands at this. It's not like it's hard. Basically, Simon points his wing and says, there it is. Dig the whole place up. Got it. All sun is into it. Oh boy. Well, now we know what those points of interest are. Time to start the digging game. 30 seconds go. Real, real close. Earth mound, earth mound, earth mound, earth mound. Nope. There it is. There were also a few Turkin feathers where the origin metal was buried. So Turkins buried it. Crafty little gigs. I guess I could keep digging if I really wanted to. But let's keep moving. Whoa. Uh, are you sure it's here? Because this is the, um, this is the danger portion 
of uh of this area. But each of the regions has basically what I refer to as a danger portion. First of all, death water everywhere. Second of all, look at these level 71 monsters. But apparently we have to go somewhere around here. I wonder if we can cross through here. Okay, the death water isn't too strong. Let's get us healed up again here. Not too strong, but I still don't want to spend too much time in it. Crap! Uh. Uh, this might take a few tries. Why did they put it here? Is that going to be too far? I guess I can climb up onto here. Level 78. Yeah, I'm not touching you. any of this. This is basically a covert mission. We get seen we're practically toast. We're getting an origin metal readout from around this area, I think. Let's leave no stone unturned. Let's turn as few stones as possible, Tyon, please. Unfortunately, this uh, misplaced level 58 uh, Swarring Rana here is what we need to beat. And there's no chance of like external interference because we got that little rectangle field to work with. Land, stop drawing aggro. That's what you get. I hate that I have an attack that works in front and an attack that works in back. I realize that's poor phrasing, but I've said it now.
Go ahead and start our team attack. Um, I should put some thought into it this time. This right. Um, Eno will end up bringing back herself. That's all right, uh, Jewel. At least you're at least you're still here. kind of want to try to get a, um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do that. I would have liked to try to get, um, uh, Bravo, but that would cost me too many players. Six and fifty-eight. That should I should be able to, to make the uh, make up the difference. Yeah, easily. This is slightly a risk because I might not have enough TP to uh, pull off one more attack, but we'll see what happens. Oh, yeah, that's not great. I might have just enough, but it's gonna it's gonna come down to luck. Uh, so I need to use Senna or Yumi, and I only have Senna here. I was hoping for a twenty five percent. I don't know who has it, but I think. Hmm. So with this I'm going to be uh, 7 points down. I need to get those 7 points. And I got those 7 points and overkill so we're done with this either way. reactivates not that we need it we're just going to go directly into the Ouroboros order um, that shouldn't exceed uh, bring out the healers doesn't really matter what I do I guess I didn't need a, a defense for or whatever. And Eno has the most TP. Let's see if we can get... Oh yeah, we got amazing. Look at that damage, 1254%. That is astoundingly high. Now how how high can we get that experience bonus? 445. Nice. 
nearly one and a half million points of damage. Lovely jubbly. How can you handle that with a straight face? <laughs> Hopefully it's not in an incredibly dangerous location. Bring us in. Waiting us is awaiting us in this cutscene. One thousand years ago. How long has this been going on? One thousand years ago? Congratulations! You're special. Precious few make it all the way to their homecoming. But this won't do at all. Your lives shine all the brighter if they are extinguished right here on the battlefield. Hmm? What's the meaning of this, Commander Chris? I bid you sheathe your blade, my Lord Consul. Come again? You want to take his shine for yourself? I am simply stating there's no need. Why kill him now? Mm -hmm. His time is at an end. How brightly he shone. He himself knows better than anyone. Your actions will not make him brighter. I'm sure. Mutiny! Why not just let it go, V? M, why are you here? When they Wait, this happened a thousand years ago? ago? Should we not grant them an appropriate departure? Don't be a fool! Then their life will be lost from circulation, will it not? Oh. Zed also wishes it so. Zed does? I refuse to believe it. You see fit then. If I may, let me send him on. And time flies, doesn't it? That's a good tune. A Chris original? Yeah, I suppose it is. Maybe I'll pinch it as well. You've got your own tunes, Noah. Those are just as good. Wonderful, I'd say. Really? I only tweaked a few notes in a score from my previous colony. It's not the notes that matter. It's the feelings you imbue them with. Feelings? Raw emotion. It resonates.
I'm confused about this timeline now. Will you respond to the Queen's awakening? The Sword of the End. Of all the vestiges of origin strewn through the world, who knew this fragment yet remained? It is no longer one with the flow. We have no means of controlling it. Will you go, then? No. There's no need, is there? He will come to me. I know it. To share with me his feelings. Feelings. Okay, so we have a console C. Is it here? It's not inside the castle. Okay, so that puts it at... Garden, Garden defense, defense space. space! Garden what now? It's a guard outpost at the castle rear. They bring new recruits there too, for basic training. Well, phew. You had me worried there for a second. Thought we'd be back in the Antal's jaws. Even so, it's an enemy base. We can't expect to just waltz in without a fight. First, let's just try to scope it out. Uh, sorry for the noise. Again, living next to a, uh, a laundry room that people should not be using at this hour, by the way. Uh, have we already had a D, and if so, did the D stand for Dracula? I can guarantee you the D did not st uh, stand for Dracula. I don't remember who console D is. Oh, my plumage is everywhere. So since we're going to to uh, Kevis Castle region anyway, there is a piece of unfinished business that I would like to take care of if I can remember what it is. Was it here? Ever complain to the ones you got the home from? I don't understand your question. I'm pretty sure I already got Fitbits, so. uh. Yeah, I already got their stone. Oh, uh, no. I believe the word you're you're looking for is landlord, which isn't a hundred percent accurate in my case, but it's close enough. I mean, the fact is, they're like, they're already supposed to be locking the, um, there we go. They're already supposed to be locking up the, uh, the laundry room. Cool. Yeah, they're supposed to be locking up the laundry room at 10, and they're not doing that. 
So that comes down to the uh, to the resident manager to do that, and if she's not going to do that, then not a whole lot I can do. All right, so where are uh, here we go? Do, 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 do. So I got a whacker. So hacker. I can do that. But there is well, one. Yeah. Uh, there is one unique that I decided to leave for on stream. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're going to have to deal with this, uh, with this team first. I want to target him on her. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say they're really that bad. They're not doing anything about uh, people not using the laundry room when they shouldn't be. But also, when it comes to maintenance requests, they are on that crap. But yes, this one here, Ambusher Tyrion. Well, now that's rude. Don't call Tyrion ugly. Jewel, don't call Tyrion ugly either. To be, to be fair, Tyrion, I wasn't expecting Hey Ugly to come out. Like mainly, mainly I like I'm not doing this out of any sort of malice. I am doing this because this guy's name is Tyrion, and I I figured it might be kind of neat to um, to unlock this guy's soul hack on stream. Damage share. That was spectacular. The Tyrion, now you get to share the damage. You were all thinking it. Good thing we found this. It's a weird coincidence. But yeah, I, I did want to uh to get that uh, that soul hack on stream while you're here specifically. Um, uh, so now I want to switch back to so Flash Winter I can do that. and do switch exactly back to Titan.
And with WoW, Lord of the Rings, or Game of Thrones inspired that name. Well, at least you're not naming yourself something like Lord British despite... Uh, actually, I don't know what you do. Because, frankly, it, if someone British calls themselves Lord British, that's a lot more appropriate than Richard Garriott. I honestly forget to... I know you mentioned it before. I My memory is like a sieve. I'm sorry. No chance from the front. Not like this. <sighs> we can go across those islands. That way, we should be able to swing around the back. Then, it's in and out, fast as we can. Yeah. We go in, we get the shard, and we hightail it out there. Right. I can't see another way. Let's do it. Yeah, it does sound cool. And there's also a game called Tyrion, but that's spelled completely differently. Chris, you were a week away from your homecoming. Why? Noah, you okay? Uh, oh, yeah. Sorry about that. Hmm? Strange. Now of all times. I have kind of lost count though of how many um I think this is how it goes. How many Mobius we've uh, we've destroyed up to this point. talking about Senna. I'm confused as to why you just kind of blurted that out for no reason. That loveness seems to be inactive. Settling. Not a single person anywhere in sight. What's going on? Is this because we busted up the Annihilator? No, I very much doubt it. We didn't do any direct damage to the castle itself. 
Maybe it's because of the Machini Queenie? Machini Queenie? Even so, we didn't actually free the soldiers here, right? And yet no one's here. Huh? The shard's changing position. Hey, Noah. Look at this. Noah? It's a song. What song? You're right. It's a Kavesi one. The melody. Yeah. And it's not just any melody. I know who's playing. Chris. Wait, Chris? Wasn't that the guy who was Noah's off-seeing instructor? Yeah. Huh? But Chris is... Yeah. He died four years ago. Does that mean he's been reborn? Like Ethel? No. I don't think that's it. What then? Like Mobius? There are two types of Mobius. The kind like Z and X, who were Mobius from the beginning, and humans who became Mobius, like N, M, and Yorin. <laughs> so, is this like a trap? Probably. But the origin metal readout is real. It's definitely here. In we go? Yeah. In we go. What? Into the jewels? They're clearly aware that we're coming. But there's no one around. He's waiting. For me. And conveniently, the doors open. I know you've been here several times. This is your castle. You trained here. The Agnian part of the group has definitely ne never been. What kind of place is this? Something weird's going on, right? The silence is unnerving. Other games would space the Mobius thing a bit more. Hmm. Good I'll consider the fact that there are 26 of them. I knew it. Chris. Thank goodness. I'm so happy to see that you're still an Offseer. Chris! Come out! Reveal yourself! I'm waiting in the throne room. Take your time. I want you to come up here. Then I want you to play that special melody. Chris! I'll be waiting. Better oh, give it a good one. Yeah. Time. I'm fine. We need to go up to the throne room. Chris is waiting. We have a fair amount of topographic data. Oh, so this is how I get to the end, to the other side of this. I was, because uh, I was here trying to map this whole area out, and I couldn't figure out how to get back here, but apparently. 
I hadn't played far enough in the game yet. The thing is telling us to go right. I'm gonna go left instead. Ah. Both trying to map everything and also, um, I first met Chris on the day of a homecoming. Get some uniques. I remember a short time later, I put in to become an officer, and then. We met again. The name's Noah, right? I'm Chris. Starting today, I'll be your personal cheater. All right? Let's begin. Hey, Chris, tell me something. Back then, on that day, why did you look so sad? Which day? The day of homecoming. In Colony 14. Ah, I see. So that's how I looked to you then. The others looked so happy. And the soldier, he was so pleased about it. But not you. I think... He probably felt content. Content? He had lived through it all. Fought hard. And in serving his colony, he found purpose. I find it's quite a tragic thing. But why? I mean, it was time for him to return home. What do you think that entails? Huh? Reaching your life's expiry date. Surviving through so many battles. Well, I... Do you honestly believe he was happy to disappear for such trivial reasons? That his smile belied no doubt? To me, he looked ready to cry. Huh. Being unable to choose his end. Merely accepting what comes next. Chris. There's no joy in a contrived death, Noah. Contrived death, huh? At this point, I get him. Kind of, at least. On that day, he shook my belief. Was I really content? Content with the path I'd chosen to follow. <sighs> and then he chose for himself. His end would be by his design. I need to know. What was he thinking back then? And why now? Why has he appeared before me? Well, let's go up and find out. You're coming too, Santa. You're not getting out of this. I've never been here before. Pff, 
Chris. Seriously, only Mobius snuffers can really do one. With a fair amount of topographic data. <laughs> I'm guessing it's just going to be elevators all the way up. I think the... Uh, I think the throne room is on the fourth floor. Why they couldn't just have one elevator that goes to the fourth floor is beyond me. Here we are back in the throne room. Point of interest. On my mark. You know what? Maybe that's a way out once we're done with Chris. So maybe we don't want to go down there yet. Oh look, they built another queen. Chris. Ourobora, you dared to appear before me once again. Do you not value your lives? Such idiocy. You should never have shown your faces here again. But you leave me no choice. For sullying this consecrated ground, I will see to it that justice is served. What a terrible din. Well, Queen's dead. Again. <laughs> Only an imitation. Its empty words could never ring true. Let me hear it, Noah. I want a true melody. Let me hear your melody. You'll hear it. Now, we, we were struggling against the level 55 or 56 earlier. Chris here is level 60 and is kind of wrecking our crap. I might need to um, revert to prime configuration here. Yeah, Noah can't play his song if he's dead. Mortal Kombat! Keep an eye on people's health here. 
Let's go. Chain attack. You know what? Let me do it. Uh, what is my face? Okay, I'm gonna I think this is front. It could be side. Right. You're still here? I'm happy to hear that. Actually, I am happy to hear that. I hope that didn't sound insincere. I'm going to gamble a little bit. A 67 and 71 is 138. I'm going to win Don't exceed, don't exceed, don't exceed. Excellent. 98%. One seventy six Bravo, got it. Did I need that extra attack? I am not sure that I did, but it made me feel better. Two reactivations. And I don't think I'm in a good position to gamble again, but I don't have a way to get another boss right now, so. Um, let's start with lands. Senna shouldn't exceed. And there's a chance that Noah is, is going to be able to get us a Bravo. Yeah, there we go. Now this is going to have to be a real good reactivation to get another order off. I think that'll do it. Um, so we got Noah and Se uh, so we got Noah and Lance, so both Neo and Senna are going to be good for another bonus order. And I'm going to go with Senna. He might be able to do it single-handed. Mm. Oh, 1043 damage. And we're going to be able to get another boss order. Ow, oh, look at that. 101 TP. Oh, that's it. Now I understand now I understand how TP gain works. Uh, it just hit me right now. That bonus TP that uh, that a character will get while doing an attack, if they get reactivated, that bonus TP reapplies to their next action. Because Noah just did 101. And that's what it took for me to understand how this works. So now if Eno were to reactivate, which she's not going to because this is an Ouroboros order, she would get 68. Oh 
and then Senna would get 57. And then Noah would get 128. I mean, there is a lot of complexity that, uh, that exists in the chain attack. You don't necessarily need to know all this in order to get a good chain attack. You realizing a mechanic on session 18 doesn't help. Admittedly, yeah, that's... Holy crap! Almost 2 million! That is a record. become Mobius? Tell me, what would possess you to side with them? So I could see you again, Noah. But why? Your sworn mission is to change this world, is it not? Yes. And is that because you're unhappy with the way it is? It's wrong, and we have to correct it. That is all. I see. So relentless desire is what drives you. Desire? You fight for betterment. For ever greater aspirations. And what's wrong with that? Nothing at all. It's human nature, after all. But you still don't understand. There's something you must learn. What's that? To be content with one's lot. What do you mean? Don't you see? Only the strong can ever hope to reach the fabled horizon that you seek. Your words must be backed up by strength in equal measure. Winner's logic. But birds, what can they possibly know of how a lowly worm feels? Then, what would you have become of the weak? Would you abandon them? You would refute their everything? End their story there? Mobius are the ones doing that. Noah, what you're trying to achieve here amounts to the same thing. You really think freeing Origin will revive the world and solve all of our problems? You must surely have heard from the Queen of Agnes the truth of this world. So what then? You're saying the Queen's lying? No. Surely not. Then what? But there is no guarantee. If... If the Queen is wrong, and the world is not created anew, what happens then? Huh? What if this is some flight of fancy? What if you've been taken in, staking your lives on a whim? Who's accountable? I ask you that. Um... Well, I... I think... It's still the right thing to do. Oh? It was your smile. Chris? Get it now. I know why you were smiling back then. I'm good here. I get what you meant now. You asked me once if I would keep moving. And my answer... Tell me, Noah. I will. To the end. So that I can treasure those final moments. Final? When that hour is upon me, I want to look back and smile. Then I'll be good. And to come out smiling, we all have to choose where our lives take us. For our future selves. And yet, lack of choice is enough to break a person. They struggle, suffer clawing their way through endless fog. A world without choice, that's wrong. If death is a lie in this world, it deserves to end. So you'd rather perish along with the world? I just, I just want to cut this world free from Mobius. Whatever the consequences. Yeah, otherwise, the Queen would never have told us the things she did. We take everything as it comes, and we're afforded so little. Still, no matter how slim a chance we might have, it's a chance. 
So if that's an option we can take, then I'll take it. Noah, your melody, I hear it loud and clear. Now show it to me, your conviction and your smile. Okay, so we're not done. Game finally reconciling the fact that we never broke the Kevis Castle flame fog. So that's what we're going to end up doing here. Let's make this machine bleed because it's definitely a thing that can happen. Lost the healer. Noah tried to uh, to interlink there, but uh, got killed. And there go both of our healers. That ended way too quickly. So, prime configuration it is. You line him up, I'll knock him down. And, uh, I'll add another healer. By the way, I'm going to switch to Noah for this. Now everyone keeps standing in the cleave. Unfortunately, there's not a whole lot I can do about that. Switch to every character in position then. Unfortunately there's no guarantee that they're going to uh to stay in their positions. Down goes Yumi. Also Miyabi is down too. Everyone's up, but we got a level three. Um, uh, that stays though. I'm gonna hit the uh, the chain attack right as the days is about to end. Uh, one additional character is reactivated with 25% chance for one more. I feel like that's something that I want to keep for at least a second, but there's no guarantee that I'm going to see it again. Me? Yes, you. <laughs> when chosen, Neo gains TP equal to 100% of Hero's TP. Maximum of 99 only applied if Neo can still act. Um, 
So I guess we do have a path to burst with her. Unfortunately, that means that uh, console Chris is no longer dazed. Um... But it's good to know that we have a path to burst because that means um, we'll be able to cancel uh, console Chris's uh, aggro. Oh, we did get three. Awesome. So we got everyone back. Uh... Alright. Yeah, and Mio gets that immediately. Look at that. She's up to 92. I don't think that uh, Noah's position to break, though. Uh, does anyone else have break? Might be able to maybe. Nah, just miss it by four points. We're still gonna get two reactivations though, and that means uh, both of them are coming back. I guess Noah could have also come back, but uh, that's not how things ended up. Both unblockable. Yeah, 112. That is gonna be an easy amazing. 112, and if that's gonna keep going up. 150. What about that? So, amazing, that means three reactivations, that means the entire party is still going to be available for this. And that's going to be another easy amazing. Oh no, I picked the wrong one. The problem is if I pick anything other than the Ouroboros Order, then the Ouroboros Order goes away. I wasn't paying attention, well that's on me. Uh, let's get let's get as many attacks as I can in here. Um, now, even though Miyabi is a healer, she is also a hero, which means she does not point. Finish this off with and get damn near 300%. And still, that's like that we only got a third of Chris's health down. That's so much defense. Also doesn't help that uh, 
console Chris seems to resist both. Just the wrong time. Come on, hit break. Uh. See, this is how this is how a proper fight's supposed to be, right? I got both pinks on both sides and switching between them and the DPS on the side. Alright, let's hit the let's hit the lucky seven. Excellent, we got burst, which means that the uh, the enrage has uh, been cancelled. I think this is the first time this happens in this entire run. Let's go ahead and hit our next chain attack. Ah, so many buffs, look at all. Play this carefully. Basically, I want to avoid using Miyabi or Mio. Really want to avoid using the Abbey, doesn't matter. Uh, I was really hoping I could get Miyabi in here. I just love that line, I used my THINKING muscles for this one! Oh, he does, huh? So I guess that's temporary. Yeah. 
I might be able to get this off. This is gonna require some luck, though. Yeah, we got this. So we're gonna get at least two reactivations, maybe three. Alright, we only got two, but those are those are good enough. Uh so Yumi lands, so that enables Senna and Tyon. We only got Senna, so. And then uh Lance should be able to get those last couple of things easily. I got awful close, I was a little nervous there. But definitely not as good of a, uh, a chain attack as the last one. But we did finish with amazing, so at least does that. Topple. Can get topple. We can't get topple. Dang. I guess we're not getting combo off, which is fine as long as I don't bungle this completely. Oh, now we get a combo. We got it. Beautiful song, Noah. Noah, the one who made me Mobius, was said. And it wasn't just me. J2 and N and M 
All of us were human once. And Zed changed our very being. Why? Why would he do that to you? For that, you'd be best off asking Zed himself. But listen, Noah. I think in the end, I was happy to have become Mobius. How could I not be after hearing such a wonderful song? Chris, Mobius are an entity bound by the confines of this world. Strong, yet somehow fragile. And in their fragility, they crave only the now, fearing to tread even a single step towards the future. I chose the path of the Offseer because I had a thought. The sender and the ones being sent. I wanted to learn exactly what it was that connected them. Though we may be forgotten, our feelings live on. It is through our melodies that we carry them on. I think I once told you something to that effect. Yeah. There's a place doing just that. The city. The city is. The many lives born of the city. Lives whose existence was never recorded in origin. They are our future. They themselves are proof of the coming winds of change. I think I see. They are... Our hope. Just as you once were. They too are the product of Ouroboros' will. And that is something that can never die. Chris. You knew everything all along. <sighs> Noah. One last thing. Send me off. This is all knows. You really do play the most beautiful tune. Go now, Noah. Sing your song for all to hear.
Noah. Huh? So those things Chris said, what was that all about? Finding value. What now? I'm guessing that we broke the plot Chris, while we were there. When he played his Obseer song, he conveyed his wish to me. It's kind of his wish or something. that I would come to find value in all things. He entrusted it all to you, Noah. Ergo, the rest is history. Yeah, but it's so. Sad, isn't it? I'm going, for sure. His wishes won't be in vain as we march on Origin. Running out of Mobius. Do you truly want it thus, O oh ye voices? Then let me enunciate, emphatically so, the rules to which this world adheres, for the benefit of us all. Iroquois side story Noah complete. After battling and defeating Consul Chris, the party acquired the last Origin Medal. Looks like colony relations have changed. And of course, since we finished Noah's side story, which was part of the main story, Swordfighter has been unlocked to level 20. Looks like we got all the medal. We need to hand these straight over to Mr. Samon. Um, okay, so we need to... Let's go get our new boat. Oh, and before we do that, I should probably uh, reset my uh, my party's makeup. A ship that can traverse even the Great Sea's vortex. Phew! Technology sure is a marvel. Yeah, I don't know what we'd have done without Mr. Salmon. I don't remember you being healer. Maybe I'm remembering I correctly. Leave the healing to me. And which class were you? Did you get to rank ten and I just didn't notice? Well whatever, you're you're this class now. But no, that doesn't make sense. Because then that means we have three heals. Oh, full Nell Jaguar. I, I, I took me a second there. You also have two classes on the go. So I got a wacken. I can do that. We've collected all the origin metal fragments. Sam and No have been watching Hall of Exploits through Turbo. Oh, and what sight it was! Friends are amazing! 
And so, so with this, Simon can create engine likes of which was before only dream. So friends just leave us to Simon. We'll need a bit of time to complete ship project. Friends can kick back until it's ready. Understood. Have fun with it, Mrs. Simon. Finally. Origin. Yes. But you did. Mobius are an entity bound by the confines of this world. Strong, yet somehow fragile. Mobius, what even are they? Harvesting our lives to cling to life, even stopping time. Mio. Allowing for limiting conditions, we are reborn after we have died. A Mobius as well. Mobius, uh, they can't be brought back once they die. Why is that? I'm not sure myself. Although each of them is fundamentally aware of this, that's why they're afraid of death. They're scared, huh? I guess you're a new too. And he still killed himself. And now, he's really gone. Still, he left us a parting gift. Yeah. The smile on his face. I'll never forget it. Not until my dying breath. And also he annihilated that psycho. What lies beyond death that Mobius fear it so? What the Queen said about the key that we hold. That smile might be it. Because he broke free of Zed's control. The power of hope, if we're being tried to. Power to create future, big props for Manana. Any way you slice it, it's not about looking backwards. More like the opposite. There's no need to rack brains about. Riku think it fine to just be true to self. Riku makes a good point. Wanting to do what we want, to be how we want to be. That's how we should carry on. In that case, I'll continue down the road of the future that was meant to be. If I were given the chance, if this road I've walked or to keep on going. I'd like to spend that time with my Noah. Keeping in mind that was Console M in, Mia, in Mio's body. Forever isn't it. Mr. Salmon. Meh, I wait for you a long time. Engine already installed. Finally, finally she finished and perfect. Congratulations, Mr. Salmon. Now I'll be able to go to Origin. Of course he will. Riku will be pilot, yeah? Yes? Oh. Uh. Hang on. I kind of unplugged myself accidentally. Also, I. I was thinking something else just now, sorry. Affirmative. Simon sent Rico information on how to steer an on equipment loadout. But first, let's look around. Meh, you all hasty as always. Simon is basking in his achievement now. Listen to explanation of ship. Yeah, Mr. Simon, we don't really get all your technical talk. Leave all that to Riku, yeah? 
That's fine, right? Oh, this is very fine, yes. Salmon have calculated optimum route for throwing ship at Vortex. Watches around far view cave are good. Salmon pr send precise coordinates, friends verify later. You do all that you do all that for us. Mr. Salmon, thank you so much. Without you, we wouldn't be able to join the battle. You let Simon help this much. Just come back alive for sure. We will. Quest complete. The ultimate vessel, bravery. The ultimate vessel is now complete. When you're ready to embark for origin, head to Farview UK. Piloting the bravery. Uh, press the L stick down while piloting the bravery to engage high velocity mode. Uh, press the L stick down again to return to regular mode. So basically, we have a button that engages zoomies. Gotcha. Alrighty. So our course is clear, and next time we shall be departing for Origin and. Hopefully, the end of the game. But that is indeed going to be for next time. So. Yeah, a lot of good progress today, but... Uh, yeah, we're going to have at least one more stream, maybe two more, at most three as I've discussed previously. And hopefully we can get this done too. Um, but I have no idea how how much longer the game is, so we'll have to see. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks to Tyrion and Jewel for hanging out. The next scheduled stream is going to be tomorrow at 8 p.m. or later, Atlantic, Day uh, Atlantic Standard Time. I'm still saying daylight. It is the... Um, Sunday Super Shuffle stream. I'm going to do some Archipelago shenanigans. Uh, next stream after that is going to be on Tuesday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. It is the regular long run stream. We're going to continue our run of uh, Spyro to Reptiles Rage Reignited. A uh, good part of the game, a good uh, part, we're through a good part of the game at this point. I imagine at most three streams and we'll be done with that, so another two. And that takes us around the week, round wheel, to our next extra long run stream next Sunday, next Saturday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. We're going to advance on Origin. Like I said, the, the next stream may end up on Friday. I don't intend to completely skip it because I do want to finish this game before the end of the year. So, that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. I'm cool here if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time.